hello youtube welcome to my channel uh thank you for watching before we get straight into the tutorial please like comment and subscribe to the channel so that you get uh, the latest be it tutorials or funny videos all right so in this tutorial we're going to be covering a toon boon project so this is the project that i have uh, unfortunately i could not corrupt it it's very hard to corrupt a, a file i discovered that the hard way <laughs> Right, so um, I'm opening. If, uh, I'm opening the project now. Uh, to open anytime from now, anytime. Uh, once it opens, uh, you'd want to uh, check first if the file is opening, because if it's not opening, it means that it's corrupted. But my file, the file that we're going to be using, is going to be opening. It's a it's a working file. But let's pretend that it's not working. The, this method works. I have tried it uh, when I did a corrupted project, but I discovered that there's no any videos on YouTube which then uh, which tell you how to recover your project. Um, not all projects can be recoverable, but uh, at least some are, are, are some some projects are, are recoverable. And Toonboon is a way of, of of copying or backing up your project as you are working, so you won't have any challenges. So let's get straight to it. Uh, firstly, you need to make a duplicate of the file that you want to recover. It, um, let's say you then fit the damage. It. So a, a copy will be very good for you in case that anything happens. So this is me making a copy there. Uh, after that, you would need to remove, uh, delete the corrupted file. Uh, that is those two files that I'm deleting there. Then you have this mark at the end so you just delete the mark at the end and uh, accept um, delete the mark at the end and accept uh, when you open it your project has been recovered let's wait for it to open yeah my machine is a bit slow so be, let's be patient a bit yeah that's the project you see the project has come back and uh, we deleted the actual um, Toonboon files then we use the backup so if you have a corrupted pro project you can use this method thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like and comment this uh, on this tutorial thank you